And here's where the tough part of this whole puzzle comes in. We gotta look for your mirror fruit. So yeah, looking for the mirror fruit, finding it is easy. Getting it to the kid is not. Dang, in the last two battles I have gotten two life bottles each battle. So yeah, they're kind of handing out the life bottles like crazy, even though they're kind of not necessary for this whole area. Anyway, I don't think we've hit this one. Or I don't even think this one does anything. Bam. Bugs. And they go away so easily. Huh. Whoa, three bugs fell. Ripples get pretty big when three fall. Oh, oh that's nice, buddy, because I still gotta figure out this puzzle. In fact, I'm pretty damn sure I'm going to be taking this week's parts to figure out this puzzle. Rain is really not letting up with the TP consumption. Look at this! She's at 35 already! Like, before the whole TP recovery at the end of every battle, she had one! One TP! Yeah, yeah I see a flower over there. Alright, so let's try this flower over here. Hopefully this even does anything. I don't think this will. Because we got to get to the stump over there, I think, to actually get the Ymir fruit to drop. In fact, I, I don't even know if that does drop the Ymir fruit. I can't remember this puzzle! Well, yeah, that brings the fish right there. I think it's gonna disappear. Yeah, I think that fish is... Because the fish is... Here in this puzzle, they're just there to push... Whatever the fuck you bring. Uh, that, that's just gonna stay there. Huh. Damn it, Lloyd! Be more insightful than that! I can't remember shit, man! I don't think this one does anything. No, actually, this one's supposed to drop the bug, but the bugs are gonna die before they even touch the ground or before they once they touch the water oh that one yep that one disappeared son of a bitch stop saying that <laughs> whoa bug oh my god I've never seen one before once ever in my life I feel so special now I don't know yeah this is gonna be a bitch for me to figure out guys if you guys are looking at me thinking this is like the easiest puzzle no it's definitely not not at all or at least to me <laughs> ah, crap, how do I go about this? There's the fish right there. I think you're supposed to call the fishes with this, but, like, that's only a distraction for once you're trying to get something through here. Oh, there's a fish right there, but... Mmm... There... Go oh, hey, look at that. Hey, it made its way through. But it's kind of pointless now, since it was bringing nothing to the in the first place. Son of a bitch. So yeah, you're supposed to bring that fish in once the sh that huge ass fish isn't looking, and yeah, if the fi if the huge fish sees it, oh uh, yeah, it's gonna eat it, and I think you have to start over. And that skit does not want to go away. You know what? I'm gonna ignore every single skit, Hossy Blay, because for now I'm trying to remember everything. And there's a lot of crap to remember here in this forest, because there's a bunch of areas you gotta get access to. I mean, there's something right here, but nah, this is. Because I'm just thinking I gotta use the boar's ability first, or like to summon a boar first. And my dog's whining. <laughs> so yeah, look for any... This is where the whole Tails Puzzles syndrome comes in for me. If you don't know what that is, oh you gotta explore every nook and cranny, explore every possibility, and then you'll be able to figure out what the hell to do with the puzzle. But this one I think is supposed to just drop down like fishes. Or not fishes. Bugs. Oh boy, I'm running around in circles. <laughs> oh man. This is gonna suck. I know this isn't gonna do anything. Why am I even bothering to check? Eh. Yeah, you guys are gonna look you guys are looking at me like a jackass, aren't I? Aren't you? Shit! I might even speed some of this up. Oh, I see something back here. Gladius. This one isn't going to do anything. Yeah, it didn't do anything. Of course. Wait a minute, something about climbing. Oh, wait, never mind. That was for the stump. I thought I would climb the tree. I'm like, wait a minute, something coming back to me. But nope, turns out it was nothing at all. And another two life bottles. Jeez, I think it's those Orcrots or whatever the fuck those its actual names were. So yeah, looking around, trying to remember whatever the fuck I gotta remember. Yeah, I might even cut some stuff out. Because, yeah, I'm not remembering anything whatsoever. I really should have done a practice run of this. I see some flowers right here. I see a path down there, but eh. Just, you know what? May as well check it. I got nothing better. 
Oh, that's for that chest right there. I think. Push the chest. Thank you, sir. Guess that's like a little extra for you, I think. Hopefully. If not, well, damn it. How was I supposed to figure that shit out? Well, well, first of all, by freaking exploring, you jackass. If you're trying to one, if you're wondering how to get to this little island right here, because this brings you to the path with the freaking rock in the huge middle. But for now, we can't get access to it because we need to get the third seed. And yeah, that's gonna be a bitch to figure out. The white seed. That's what the fuck. What? So that was required. All right. I'll keep the rage bottled up for now. Then. Fuck this game. <laughs> <laughs> At least fuck this puzzle. My god. Do you guys saw that? Oh boy. Alright, so let's go get this one planted. And then we'll be able to get access to all these other areas. And we should be able to figure out this puzzle from here. Jeez. Why didn't I not check that the first time I saw it? Because I saw it, I was like, eh, that's probably just to push something. Well, it was to push something, but eee. Not. I didn't think it was a necessary thing. Or at least not until now. And now with the white seed, these flowers actually point pop up on these branches. This is my white flower boom. Sure, there are other white flowers. Of course, there is rain. So if we try using this one right now, hey, get on there, Lloyd. Don't be a pussy. Jump on the branch. Wee! <laughs> so yeah, we ride a hawk somewhere, and we just drop the wooden box right here. For some reason, there's a wooden box on top of a tree. No idea how it got there, but yeah, I'll take it. And I think with here, from here, now we can actually get the Ymir fruit to appear, but for now, we gotta get everything else uh, set up. Because getting the Ymir fruit to drop from that tree, that's simple enough. But getting it to the kid, that's the actual puzzle, I suppose. Yeah, up until now, I was just getting lost over nothing. So, yeah, I think I saw a branch over here. Yep, this I remember. I think. This might take us to the one little part where the we have to get that board to slam into the boulder. I like how that freaking pawn can just carry us like nothing. He's like, hey, let's go, buddies. I got the strength of a ox. Okay, I think this wasn't necessary then. Yep, this was just pointless. This is just like trying to detour you. So, let's make our way back. And look for other branches because we gotta get everything set up for figuring out how to get the Ymir fruit to the kid. If I remember correctly, there may be some branches around here. Hopefully there is. I can't remember exactly. I can't remember exactly where the branches are at, but we'll get to them. We will find them. And we will fucking kill him. Or them. I don't know what the hell I'm even talking about anymore. Oh, there's one. Alright. At least they stand out. Like, they don't blend in with the surroundings, because then this would just be an annoying-ass puzzle. Take me there! To heaven, for some reason. There we go. Here's where we gotta go for slamming the rock in. Or breaking in the rock. Breaking in Dwayne Johnson. There we go. Alright. We can't cross through there, but that's examining boulder is shattered. Of course it is. So, now to get the Ymir fruit to this kid. I think that's like the main obstacle of this whole puzzle, so yeah. To the Ymir fruit, which we can access with a wooden box. Get on the freaking ranch. There we go. I'm trying to sound all relaxed because I'm on spring break right now. Like, and so far, I'm, I'm waiting for like my freaking classes to show my grades because I've only gotten one so far and it's like my uh, assembly language programming class. And there's the fruit. Like my assembly language programming class. <laughs> we can't reach it. There are dangerous looking fish in the water. We can get those little fish to help us. Uh, of course we can. So yeah, I only know the grade for my assembly language class. And I got like a C plus on that. So yeah. Trust me, I could have gotten at least a B. But I forgot to turn in a couple assignments here and there. Like even a lab. Like even a lab assignment. And yeah, those are worth quite a bit so yeah I kind of forgot about turning those in some some I was late some of the labs I was late with but yeah screw it all I managed to get a C plus and that's better than a C minus because uh, you need to get an average of C or more up oh, crap screw you buddy 
So we gotta get that uh, freaking fish to get distracted. Damn, we gotta do the whole thing over again. So yeah, that's the frustration. If those fish eat the fruit, you have to do the whole puzzle. You have to get that fruit all over again. So yeah, I gotta make my way back here. Get on the stump with the weirdly long animation. Get another fruit to drop. And I'm surprised it fell from the exact same spot. Not gonna mess up this time. Oh, of course we are, Lloyd. So yeah, remember all those spots with the worms? Well, we're gonna have to make extensive use of those. Nothing good for this one though. Nope. So yeah, they only. Oh right. Oh, three bugs filled. Yes, of course they. He acts all shocked too. <laughs> the hell, Lloyd. So yeah, we gotta make our way over here to this tree. Here we go. This is the one I was thinking of. I guess like the big fish don't show up until you make your way to a certain point. In this case, it's the beginning, so this fish is gonna be here for now. So we gotta distract them with the worm. And while he's eating that, hurry the fuck up. And let's get that freaking fish to push it across it. Or wait from it. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Get off the freaking stump. <laughs> I can't remember this for shit. <laughs> I'm actually surprised this is taking me 40 minutes. And then again, I think like 10 of those 40 was like us figuring out where the Zircon and shit was at. I think. I can't really remember. So get it past him. Hopefully the fish is still distracted. I don't know what's the waiting period on that. Yep, look at that. Hooray for oblivious fish. Okay, if another fish shows up right then and there, I'm going to be kind of pissed. So yep, I think here the next fish, like another big fish is going to show up where that one's at. So we got to think ahead, I think. Yeah, there's one right here. Jesus. And then we got to get the Ymir fruit through here and got to wait for this fish to not be in its way. So here's the tough part. Oh, wait, damn it. Where do I go? Oh, right. Jeez, I forgot. It's like hidden right behind this huge-ass tree. I keep forgetting about it. Come on, fishy. Man, I'm all nervous because I don't want to do this all over again. If I screw up, like, pretty damn far into it, I'll just cut to when I get back. So, so far, nothing. So far, so good, though. <laughs> oh, wait, it's still there. I think it's waiting for us to give the call. Oh, crap. Crap, 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 crap. Damn it. I'll be right back. Alright, guys, I'm back, and I got the fruit to appear right near this tree where the three worms fall. And I remember why they point out, oh, they make huge-ass ripples, so you gotta get the freaking worms to fall out of there. There we go, buddy. And it's closer, farther away from there, so I think with that, now we can actually call that fish again. Hopefully. Only one way to find out. Yep, the fruit's right there, and it should be going down this path, instead of like going straight to where that, uh, freaking huge fish was like standing right in front of it. Oh yeah, and I took that chosen sickness skit off, because yeah, that was just getting annoying. It just stood there, man. And now we got a new skit, and it's actually relevant to what we're doing. Hey. So, Ymir fruit. Ymir fruit, huh? I bet it tastes good. Ah, no, Lloyd, you can't eat it. We have to give it to that child. Lloyd, how could you think such a thing? I'm disappointed in you. Lloyd, that's just wrong. Okay, okay, it was just a thought. Lloyd, looks like they're treating you the way they treat me. I think we can be good friends. <laughs> ah, don't drag me into your world. <laughs> Freaking Zelos, seriously, and I think it'll stay there, and now we just gotta call it once that fish is out of the way. And get, move out of the way. There we go. Now I think with this we should be good. Don't turn over here, you fucking fish. There we go. And now it's bringing it all the way to the beginning of the area, I think. And then from there we just gotta get... The fruits, and yes, from there it'll actually be grabbable. 
I don't see why they... Eh. Well, they had to extend this puzzle somehow. So, is it a punishment? Colette, is your body okay? Yes, I'm sorry to worry you. I see. It's good then. And she's... Yeah, I wonder if... Of course, if this is a punishment. Because I quit the... Because I quit the world regeneration. Nonsense! You suffered through all that all by yourself. How could anyone want to punish that? Thank you, Lloyd. Oh, of course, because she's crying. Damn it, why does she cry so much? And I see the fish over there. Hello, fishy. Bring me the fruit so I can beat you with it. God damn it, I hate these fish. So we just gotta call him with this. And I think with this, we get the fruit. I think I made this out to be a lot harder of a puzzle than I thought I did would. Well, it's definitely hard if you're going through this the first time. And there's the fruit. Yes! That took forever. Of course it did. Took me the last... Well, from what I recorded the last part, it took me about 43 minutes. Holy crap. So just get on this. Stay there for a while, because apparently stepping on a lily pad, like, stuns you for a bit. And now we got the Ymir fruit. Now let's get it to that kid. Get into Heimdall. And get the fuck out of here. Or at least not get the fuck out of here. We gotta still grab whatever the hell we gotta get here. I think we gotta get a mana leaf herb. If I read correctly. Uh, feeling all zoned out right now because last night I actually did drink a bit. <laughs> I drank a bit, saving now. And yeah, I didn't even drink that much, honestly. Like my friend's cousin, though. Oh boy, he binged on the drinks. And he threw up in my trash can. In and around my cat trash can. You guys are different. Thank you very much. And we got a metal sphere. Alright. In time, doll. He drank so much, dude. Yeah, he dr threw up in front of my house and in and around my trash can. So you made it here. What? Then you, you do know how to cure Colette's illness. And if I did? Why are you helping us? Why are you giving us clues about how to save her? How do you know that Angel's Colette's angel toxicosis was the same illness that one of Mythos' the hero's companions had? And what do you hope to accomplish by asking that? Oh, uh, well, there's no time. Hurry. Well, that's nice. The village of the elves. No half-elf may pass. What? This is a defensive measure against those who brought catastrophe to our village. If you cannot accept that, then you humans may not enter either. Lloyd, we'll wait here. We'll leave the rest in your hands. All right. Yeah, damn right, get the hell out of here. Nah, I'm kidding. Ah, oh, that's so fucked up. Ta ce talk celebrating Risos as a hero is forbidden in this village. Why? We, ha we have no need to explain. Just do as we say. Well, that's nice. So, the hidden elven village, Heimdall. Alright. Where the hell's the mayor's house? Oh, wait a minute. There's a bunch of stuff you can buy here. Very nice. Heimdall weapon shop. And we can actually come... Twilight Arms. Twilight! No! No! <laughs> Fuck that! Yeah, I got plenty of money. So, may as well. Lost your rapier. Uh-huh. Thank you that. I think we could... Oh, wait. We already have a rune staff. I think Northern Lights Regina. So I can't remember. That. And that. We got a Gladius and that. Everyone else has their weapons. Just fine. Oh, wait a minute. We only have to buy that then. And maybe the Northern Lights. There we go. I haven't equipped anything new on the, these guys. So, let's just get some armor for them then. Oh, we can get a rune made for Zelos. Rune cloak for him. Oh, I think we could probably get it on Genus too. Rune robe for Sheena. I think, yeah, we do. Getting all this crap. One for Zelos, or not for Zelos, Regal. And, damn, I'm out, of, I'm out of money. I'll have to go hunt that dragon. I'll have to hunt him like crazy now. Alright. Getting that. Rune Helm, Rune Mail, there we go. Where the hell is everything at? Nope. There we go. Hey. What the hell did I just buy? Oh, there we go, Vajra. Rune Robe, Tartan Ribbon, nope. Pingless Gloves, lovely mittens, there we go. Silk Gloves, Tartan Ribbon, yeah, where's everything I bought? Crystal Shell right there, Rune Cloak for him, and yeah, give him the headband, why not? I'm trying to figure everything out. <laughs> There's so much shit I haven't caught up on. There we go. And a Gladius Fruit Zelos. A dagger, of course. You know what? I think I'm going to cut it for this part. Because, yeah, I've been exploring the freaking... I've explored that forest for far too long. 
So I'm going to be calling it quits for this part, guys. So if you like this part, give it a like, subscribe if you want to watch future videos, and feel free to watch any of my previous videos if you really feel like it. Next time on Let's Play Tales of Symphonia, we're going to be uh, looking for the Manaly Verb. So see you guys then.